Well, for many of us, home automation goes about as far as the clapper. Clap your hands and a light turns on or off. But you can do a lot more these days. I.J. Hudson joins us now to tell us about it. I.J.? Susan, you don't even need to use your hands for this. As our personal computers get faster, a lot of things get better, including speech recognition. And that's important for automating your house, controlling lights, temperature, with your voice, whether it's in the home or in the car. Rich Tinker has taken home automation to a new level. He talks to his computer called Rosie. Set the family room thermostat to 68 degrees. Okay. When I come in the door and disarm the security system, it will set the temperature back to a comfortable level, because while I was gone, I had it set back. And then if I got any phone calls over the speakers, it'll tell me that I have three new voicemail messages. At the center of Rich's system, a PC loaded with software from Home Automated Living, HAL, and special modules. We give you the ability to, to take our system and plug it in the back of your PC, and immediately the PC will recognize all the wires in your home. Everything that's plugged into the, into the power line, this system can talk to. In Rich's case, that includes a gas fireplace. Turn on the family room fireplace. Rich can control the stereo, TV, security system, lights, thermostat, by voice. Speaking to Rosie through microphones in the wall, or from any phone, in the house, the car, or anywhere. And while Rosie can be stubborn, even I was eventually able to control the lights. Hello, Rosie. Yes. Turn the kitchen lights on. Okay. The system also checks the internet periodically to update sports scores and stock quotes. What's Microsoft at? Microsoft is currently at 64 on volume of 81,400. Rich is a kind of gadget guy and is going all out for his system, but you can get started with home automation for as little as $60. That's a Rich's portfolio, not mine. Kits range from 60 to several hundred dollars, depending on the number of modules you buy. Now, we have a link to Home Automated Living, HAL, on our website. Just go to NBC4.com and click on News Links. You can also visit my Digital Edge site with transcripts of recent stories.